Hello everyone, Lotus FPS here, welcome back to another video. Today I'll be showing you how to stretch resolution. So I got this one comment like yesterday, uh he says can you do a tutorial on stretch versus crim? And I said Yeah sure. So I'm gonna teach you how to do stretch resolution because some of my friends also ask the same question on how to do stretch resolution. So for starters, you always require an NVIDIA control panel. That's the first thing you require to have for stretch resolution. If you got any other options for stretch resolutions, uh, just say comment, uh, comment down below and some people might actually know how to do that without using NVIDIA control panel. So yeah, I hope you'll be helpful if you want to try doing that. So it's quite easy. You just go to change res uh, change resolutions right here. All right, it's right here. And then you see this is my custom. We got Ultra HD and we got PC. So PC, this is native, all right? This is my native right now. And what I always use is this, in, because he has 75 hertz, and that's the main hertz that I have on my on my monitor right now. I don't have more than 75, but it's okay as long as I still play Grim or other games. No, so it'll be fine. And just click apply, and boom, you have stretch resolution. And if you don't like how my resolution is like, you can either choose other options or you just want to customize your own but remember if you want a customized customizable um resolution you require a suitable one actually like this one that my friend made for me and this is his resolution and it's compatible to the monitor that i have so yeah uh that's pretty much it so let's give it a try on the lowest maybe like this one right here the lowest this is Pi's is resolution, just so you know. It's very small, and I don't like the look of it. However, this is my favorite one at least. This one right here. Yep. Uh, just click apply, and bada bing, bada boom. You got it. And then you can just check out on Krim. Oh, and uh, you can just check on Krim. Alright, as you can see, this is the native resolution that I have right now on my uh, PC right now. Normal resolution for Krim, right? This is for Krim. This is a normal resolution. My FPS may be going down if I don't use stretch resolution, so that's, what the re that's the reason, one of the main reasons I like to use stretch resolution, because it increases a little bit my FPS. And this is normal, alright? This is normal resolution. You see how small I am right now? Now I'm gonna do with stretch res resolution. And with that, as you can see, my FPS is boosting right now, look at this, is increasing by 80, 90 to 100, uh, something like that, yeah. And this is how tall I am now, like I'm a little bit short. So yeah, that's the main reason why I like to use stretch resolution, and it's also uh, a little bit nice to play with, since, since most pro players and mostly a lot of people like to use stretch resolution. Well, not that many, because many people like to keep it in native, you know, like to keep it in style, keep it in... Maybe like a beautiful way to just play Krim. So yeah, um, if you can't do, so yeah, if you can't do the stretch resolution thing, even though you have Nvidia, but it still won't work, then uh, I don't know. Uh, I don't. I'm not. That's all. That's all I know. I'm not professional in this. I don't know. This is what I'm. Sh I'm just showing you what I can do and what I know. So yeah, please subscribe, and I will. This is helpful enough for you Krim players to actually play stretch res. Uh, yeah. Goodbye.